Sutton coming into the weekend that he wasn't going to play every game. They were going to kind of feel it. Feel it pitch. Pro far. Golf swan. Deep. It's off the base of the wall. Old Tony, new Tony. Pro far. On three. A one two pitch. Threw him the split. And tough play. Bare hand. Turner, Muncie, and Taylor through the heart of the lineup. Trey stopped hold before his first start of the season. Scratched runs. That's fine. Freeman lifts the ball to deep. He's got room. Four out number. His one-two to Will Smith is cut on and missed. Pops one first baseman. Fouls out to another. A one-one pitch to Nola. Here. Two away. Got Taylor again. And a one-two. Curve gets him swinging. And he hits a high fly ball down the line. If it's fair, it's gone. It is a fair ball and a home run. Two pitch. Taylor swings and misses. Sharply hit. Tom Kim to get to another one, two. And gets him with the splitter. Jay Abrams. Back to back K's and the splitter again. Driven to left at first. Now goes back and it's Jerks and Profar up his 0 for 8. Slide to deep. He's there. And he knows first pitch. Yeah. Trent Grisham. Dodgers being aggressive. For... Rifled down the line. Austin. Hey, Turner. There goes his throw from home. Not in. Big strikeout right there. First. Swing and a miss. Made it good. <laughs> for sure. I'm just trying to introduce her to things that I like doing. Uh, but... Oh, shoot. Off the wall. Muncy read it well. And a ringing double from Trace Thompson. Swing and a miss as he struck him out. High heat. Reach back. A little extra there. Swing and a miss. And he strikes out Barnes. Comes back downhill. And strikes him out with the splitter. High drive to right field. Down the line towards the pole. That ball is gone. Home run for Trent Grisham. Ties the score. Ground ball left side. Back in the throw and gets it. Freddie Freeman, he'll feed Gonsolin. He gets him too. Buckling. Not only get hit, get a one two again. He leaves it high and it's two. And he did. Spinnerfield base hit. The opposing man. Good rhythm ball exactly where you want. Pass for time, didn't get it. Strike one. Two. In the dirt, there goes Smith. Nolo's throw. Not off before that. Got him to chase, and he did. Ground ball. Max Munk finally gets back to back. He catch Cronenworth pops over there for out number two. Luke Voigt with the bases empty and two gone gets a first pitch slider. Strike one. Dolts is punch. There. One two three six for Tony Gonsolin. High fly ball. Chopper left side, cut off slick. Strikes, here comes to Mazzara. Right, Muncy's there, there's the first out on the team. That's uh, Taylor for out number two. Said if he had chosen football because Texas, he might be an NFL linebacker. That's one's 0-2. Got him! Turner ends. And a wet Marisol. There goes Trey Turner. Throw from Nola. Not in. That's the other way. Base hit Freddie Freeman. A thing of beauty. Who splits the gap and heads to second. Dodgers lead 3-1. Fires a 2-1 pitch. His second hit of the game. Target set high. Fastball gets him. Here he comes. Got him. Up the... Thompson crushes him. Padres catch a break as that ball... Fly ball makes the catch. Miss throw goes to third. And Taylor's in the score. Chopper diving stop by CJ Abrams. What a play! Excellent. From Craig Kimball as Cronenworth flies to Chris. A huge presence. Voigt goes Bellinger to the track. He's got to oh, just get under it. Take 
the first two from the Padres. Tony, first, just what a night you had out there on the mound, your first time pitching into the eighth inning. How did you not only maintain your rhythm, your composure, but navigate that lineup so effectively? Uh, yeah, I mean, they're a really good lineup. You know, they hit top to bottom. Uh, nobody's a free out on that lineup. And uh, just trying to get strike one today, and uh, I feel like I did a pretty good job of doing that. And then uh, I was really landing all my off-speed stuff for strikes today, which was huge. Um, but overall, I felt, I felt great out there. And Cody Bellinger hit that home run to break up the tie. Did that allow you to just kind of take a, a deep breath as you were navigating the lineup? Uh, I never really tried to relax tonight. Uh, Cody hit that home run. I knew I wanted to go back out there and uh, he put up a zero and keep us in the ball game, and um, I did that. You have the lowest ERA in Major League Baseball. What does that mean to you when you consider all of the hard work you have put into when you really have focused and locked in this season? Um, it feels good, you know. Just trying to go out there and, uh, and do my job and keep us in games and, um, you know, hopefully uh, control what I can control. And, um, you know, baseball is pretty hard. It's hard to hit a ball. And, uh, you know, sometimes they do, and it's, uh, that's okay as well. But uh, just trying to go out there and throw strikes. All right. Now the All-Star game is only a few weeks away. It is here at Dodger Stadium. What would it mean to you to be the starter for the National League in that game? Uh, I don't want to get ahead of myself at all. You know, I threw well tonight. Uh, I'm looking forward to next start. And, um uh, I'm going to enjoy the night and the goal is to win tomorrow. Thank you so much, Tony. You should be very proud about how this night went. Thank you. What kind of your opinion on Tony today? Just how efficient he was. Um, he was outstanding tonight. Um, I, I thought he had his entire mix working. Um, the split change. Uh, obviously, there's a heavy left-handed lineup. Um, fastball command all night long. He's getting a lot of early swings, early contact, kind of allow him to get to that eighth inning. And... Um, you know, sort of where we're at with the pen or where we were going into tonight, uh, much needed, but he's just pitching his tail off and he's just so, been so consistent for us. So they ripped Machado up, tied for anything. That's not probably the year past he wouldn't have even gotten to, let alone been lucky in for him. How much does that sort of show his growth? Well, his growth, growth has been exponential. I, I think that, um, you know, even to be able to take down 27 or 36 hitters, 27 hitters, 27 hitters. Um, is a big deal. And uh, even in the Machado spot, he's just really, like I've said before, is he's just understanding how to navigate a lineup and, and understanding that to see him once, twice, and then three times, how to get through that lineup the third time. And um, it was good at bat. It was good, that was good to see him, uh, that sequence with Machado. How much does he still surprise you that he's just doing the start after start? Um, I, I don't think it should surprise anybody anymore. I think he's in just such a good place uh, mentally, physically. Um, he really, like I've talked about, he knows who he is as a big league pitcher. And uh, he's making pitches, and uh, when there is potential stress, he finds a way to make pitch to get out of the jam. How was the C-Max jumping that first pitch? It was good. You know, uh, Blake's tough on uh, left-handed hitters, and um, so to see Max get the first pitch fastball, I think he was middle in, not try to do too much with it, but elevate it to the pool side. Um, really good to see. and. Um, you know, the Freddie, Freddie at bat, uh, Trace Thompson was, was big for us tonight, a couple doubles, and then uh, the situational sack fly um, by Cody was great, and then Austin driving in a run late. So just the ability for us to tack on late um, was good, as well as kind of getting to Snell or trying to weather him because he was, he was pretty good. He was really good tonight. How strong is Tony's pace to start, though? Um, he, he's making a case. Um, I, I'm just trying to, he's got a couple more starts and just want him to continue to pitch well and, you know, whatever Brian Snitker decides. But, uh, you know, Tony's making a great uh, case for himself. How much would you be in Snitker to Eric? Um, you know, uh, not, not too much as far as a starter. Um, I've had that opportunity to manage the All-Star game a few times, and I don't recall any manager lobbying for his pitcher to start the game. So I think it sort of plays out the way it should and it'll be a pretty obvious choice.